It's now a mural of Kobe Bryant and his daughter in Fresno. Muralist Omar Super Huerta started it last night, and it's not completely finished, but people are already stopping by and taking photos. CBS 47's Jocelyn Moran joins us live in Fresno with more on that beautiful artwork. Jocelyn. That's right. Now, we've been here at different points in time, and people have been coming in before work, after work, to pay their respects. Now, the muralist, Super, says that this is exactly why he decided to do this mural, so that people could have something to share and something where they could honor all those people who died tragically. With candles lit up and the Fresno community looking on, muralist Omar Super Huerta began painting this mural of Kobe and his daughter Gianna Thursday night. And by the time the sun rose this morning, Super was there talking to people who stopped by to take photos. Pretty much I painted him, painted him for everyone because uh, I'm sure everyone's going through the same thing. I'm going to the emotional side of it. We came to just pay our tributes and see what's going on. We heard about it last night and we're like, wow, we got to see that. Super says he didn't realize how much support he was getting until a couple of hours into painting. I was so focused for the first two hours and I finally turned back to see, you know, and, and there was a lot of people out here that we had a lot of uh, support. Yeah, man. Appreciate it. Honestly, it was, it, was, it was breathtaking for me, you know, as an artist. He spent more than four hours on Thursday night projecting the image of Kobe and Gianna while he painted over it. What I saw on this picture here is a great bond between a father and a daughter. And now it's an image that people in the valley can have to remember the great Kobe Bryant, his daughter, and others on the helicopter who lost their lives on that tragic Sunday. He was a part of my childhood, and now he's just gone. And, you know, paying our tributes and respects is something important to us. And Super says he's not quite finished. He plans on coming back this weekend to finish the mural and include all nine names of those who lost their lives this last Sunday. Reporting in Central Fresno, Jocelyn Moran, CBS 47 Eyewitness News. Jocelyn, thank you so much. What a beautiful tribute. That really is, yeah. and including all the victims on that helicopter. Yeah. That's wonderful. Great job.